Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In a bid to fortify its military forces amidst ongoing sanctions and trade blockades, the Venezuelan National Guard has undertaken a strategic initiative, adding two refurbished variants of the French AMXVCI armored combat vehicles to its units stationed in Porta La Cruz, Anzo Ataguay. This move, which commenced in mid-2022, saw 50 units transferred from the Venezuelan army to the National Guard, marking a pivotal step in bolstering Venezuela's fourth military component. Venezuela's journey to restore its military prowess has been marred by international sanctions that have significantly impeded its access to Western combat system spare parts and technical support. Spearheaded by the United States and backed by other Western nations, these sanctions have targeted various sectors of the Venezuelan economy, including defense, leading to a dire shortage of essential components and maintenance services. The origins of these sanctions trace back to 2014, amidst mounting concerns over Venezuela's political landscape and human rights situation under the leadership of President Nicolas Maduro. Initially focused on individuals and entities implicated in human rights violations, the sanctions escalated during the Trump administration to encompass broader economic domains, such as the financial system, oil exports, and the defense industry. Measures included severing Venezuela's access to the U.S. financial system, asset freezes, and halting oil imports. The repercussions of these stringent measures reverberated across Venezuela's armed forces, severely compromising the operational readiness of critical systems like the French tracked armored vehicles. Dating back to the early 1970s, Venezuela procured over 50 AMX-13 light tanks and AMX-VCI vehicle to combat de-infantry, armored personnel carriers from France. While the AMX-13s were integrated into an armored brigade, boasting an oscillating turret and a formidable 75mm gun, the AMX-VCI variants, based on the AMX-13 chassis, assumed multifaceted roles, including command posts, mortar carriers, and ambulances. In response to the dire need for self-sufficiency, Venezuela embarked on an import substitution program aimed at cultivating domestic capabilities for refurbishing and maintaining military equipment autonomously. This program seeks to diminish reliance on foreign components and services by fostering the establishment of local production and repair facilities. The initial tranche of 50 rejuvenated AMX-13 M56 VTT vehicles was transferred to the National Guard in May 2022, with subsequent deliveries occurring in smaller batches. The AMX-VCI, an offshoot of the AMX-13 light tank conceptualized by France in the early 1950s, was conceived as an armored personnel carrier, APC, before evolving into specialized iterations tailored to diverse military requisites. Widely employed by numerous nations, Venezuela acquired these vehicles in the early 1970s to augment its armored brigade capabilities, deploying them for functions such as infantry transport, command posts, medical evacuation, and artillery support. The AMX 13M56 VTT VCI stands as an infantry combat vehicle hinged on the AMX 13 chassis, engineered to ferry and reinforce infantry units during combat operations. Typically outfitted with a turret mounted machine gun, be it an AA-52 7.5mm machine gun or a 12.7mm M2 Browning machine gun, this variant can accommodate up to 10 infantrymen. Diverse iterations encompass command post vehicles, mortar carriers equipped with 81mm or 120mm mortars for indirect fire support, and anti-tank guided missile ATGM, launchers. On the other hand, the AMX 13M56 VTT TB transport blesses epitomizes an ambulance variant tailored for battlefield medical evacuation endeavors. Capable of conveying up to four stretcher patients or multiple seated wounded soldiers, this variant ensures armored protection for patients and medical personnel alike. While upholding the base model's agility and durability, the AMX 13M56 VTT TB is equipped with interior lighting and medical equipment storage, facilitating immediate care en route to medical facilities. In conclusion, the reintroduction of restored French AMX VCI armored vehicles into Venezuela's military arsenal underscores the nation's resolve to surmount adversities posed by international sanctions. As Venezuela endeavors to cultivate indigenous capacities for refurbishment and maintenance, the revitalization of these combat systems serves as a testament to the nation's resilience and determination to safeguard its sovereignty amidst formidable challenges. That's all for now. See you later.